Yep, him crash, so... Let's see if we can do this again. Varys, uh, who sent you here? Okay. Let's try the same path. Like vampire. Yes. Not fond of vamp. Well, look, I can help you find out what that is. Where do you need to go? My family. By the right. way, my name is Serana. How long Good were you me. locked in there, and why? I... I'm sorry. Let's get to my home, and I'll have a better sense of. Good question. I, I feel like it was a long time. Oh, wonderful. Who are the contenders? Empire. What? Cyrodiil is the seat of an empire. I must have been gone longer than I thought. Definitely longer than we planned. Please, let's hurry. I need to get home so I can figure out what's happened. Is that an Elder Scroll? Yes, it is. And it's mine. Why do you have an Elder Scroll? It's... complicated. I can't really talk about it. I'm sorry. Yeah, this... I don't like this. This goes against what... this is... I don't want to talk in the dialogue mode. There's a time limit. Tell me about your home. It's on an island near Solitude. Hopefully we can find a boat to take us there. It's my family home. Not the most welcoming place, but depending on who's around, I'll be safe there. Why wouldn't you be safe? Let's just say that my mother and father had a bit of a falling out. Don't worry, I'm not in any danger or anything like that. It'll just be more unpleasant to run into my father. How do we get out? Your guess is as good as mine. This place looks pretty different from when I was locked away. Yep. Yeah. My problem with this is... It's not just going a little bit with the... With where the story wants to go. It is... We are a vampire hunter. We're, we joined E here to fight against vampires. And uh, we came here to investigate vampire activity. We we're killing vampires on site. But suddenly, this clearly super important vampire who's carrying an uh, Elder Scroll, we're, we're, we, we can't do anything but hate her. What is that? Cargoes. In these yet. Uh, I should I should have tried to either kill her or try to take her forcefully to see Isran. At least try to get the Elder Scroll away. Here? Those oh, would have been sensible be choices given the explanations here. I, I guess her only sort of justification is yeah, there's something bigger going on, so you just have to do everything I say. And sort of pretend like she doesn't know what's going on. And immediately in the dialogue she basically just says she doesn't really want to talk. So capturing her, something like that should be an option. Uh, that would be the logical progression. And they just aren't giving me a reason to really aid her, but... I'm not going to bother trying to bring her to the Dawn Guard because I know that's impossible. She will not walk with you there. So it's just a waste of time. This feels the right way. I was starting to worry. It'll be good to get outside and breathe again. I haven't missed the sunlight, but I do miss fresh air. I'm surprised they didn't give... Well, 
I suppose that's the danger of having to develop role-playing games where you have very little role-playing is you get lazy. I'm sure Bethesda has uh, great writers who are more than capable, but but you get into the well, I can't say if they're the flame, but I would assume so. Is that you don't really have to because you always railroad everything in your games. You don't really have to provide that reasonable dialogue and the, the logic. The logic behind the actions, because you never do. You never provide them. You sort of uh, assume that the player rolls with it or makes up their own reasoning. So when you switch to this, where you're supposed to at least offer some kind of reasoning why you act, as, uh, what I would consider out of character and you don't, you just brush it away, it bothers me. It's not a huge deal, I, I'm playing this like an adventure game, I don't particularly think too much about my character. Because there, what's the point? There is no option to really roleplay. So there's no point thinking about it too much. But bothers me because here it's uh, it's so obviously against what we should have done. It's not just really hard to just roll with it. I guess we're rolling with it with after arriving about it a little bit. Just doesn't feel right. Could have given us better reason. Have her use her vampire influence or something on us, anything. I mean, provide a... yeah, you can accept what she's saying, but if you don't, the game is it can somehow force the issue to go that way anyhow. Who's there? Holding Grover. No way to Boost Sorry about that, Serana. Some kind of a death lord there. Kroger Jeff, oh lord. I'm out of my tick up. I got stuck there. Serana on the other side, and I guess a staircase I didn't see on the back side. I, I really can't see you as shit here. I cannot see it. I'm gonna rely on summon creature for a while. Who's there? This way I don't have to see it, but the other is for the work. <sighs> I think it, it, I'm basically sunlight hitting directly in my face. I, I can't see shit. I can see something around the fires, but besides that, yeah, 
Yeah, I didn't see that there was a hole up there. I probably want to fight him alive. Harder to hide, but at least I can see what's going on. Overlord doesn't particularly get staggered our sales anymore. That's nice. Who's I, I generally mean that that's nice because uh, it's too easy. Now we know we're starting to. Not sure how many of them are. But we're starting to face situations where we just can rely on the same mode. Done and done. And done. Okay, I need to twist the lighting situation here a little bit. I don't know really what's going on. What's going on around here. Malachite. Malachite would be... Well, you can make glass weaponry and armor from Malachite. Not sure why I would be gathering up Malachite though. Or Malachite? Yeah, I'm not used to Malakad really. Just it. Ah, loots. Loots is the thing I wanted. Fearless alchemy. Expert robes of alteration. Gold. Health regeneration. Paralyze. Stamina. Brain vitality. Hoax both magical and mortal energies from your hapless opponent. Well, I guess this is a vampire ability of a sort. It would fit the theme just fine. Okay, I think we're good. Ah, I'm into the daylight. Mm -hmm. Not too bad. It's so good to breathe again. This weather is incredible. So, where do we need to take you? Serrano to her home. Mm. 
those pine moon cave and shouldn't be too much problem. We want to go here. Or maybe here. It's hard to say from this angle, but but we are looking for here at least. There seems to be a path down to the coast. Here it's not so clear if there is. I think I'll just head north. Use the guaranteed path. Lost Echo King. I have quite a lot of Weight, but at the same time, don't expect to go exploring anything now. Just want to escort Rana home and see what happens next. What word of power are we using? I don't know how this works. A little bit rigid. Can take damage. Okay, gigantic monstrous vampire castle. Where we need to go? Sea for burrow. Another cave. I've spent enough time underground myself, but if you want to go in, I'm right behind you. Fuzzy button. Yes, uh, death blooded some brain damage to it. New Who's saber there? cats. I knew I had something. G 
Not exactly expecting a lot of resistance here, so the paralyzed plus dagger combination should be good enough for anything. Lower C full barrel. I particularly want to pick pots with workers. Totally harmless. Where'd you come from? Done and done. I think we need to look a lot without training. We're getting so much experience levels at various skills, so I want to keep delaying it. It's not like the training is absolute must-have thing anyway. It was a great way to get things going at the start without... well, you can't do everything. But once you get things above a certain uh, skill range, you, you don't really need the training anymore. Still, I would mostly like to train the league to an every level. If it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. It's not a... It's not that big of a deal. It's like an NPC dying, really. I don't want that to happen, and I'll try to make sure that it doesn't happen, but if it happens, it happens. We're on a boat. Ice water chip. I do feel pretty secure here. I mean, this is a must have path. We can hardly fail here, not can we? We'll get into too much trouble. Bone hawk. These are crafting items, not uh, al alchemical items. More of a smithing item. This must be that beautiful Skyrim weather I've always heard about. I don't think a single bird is enough for anything. Two and three, maybe we have something that we can cra craft out of these. I think there was some kind of an amulet. I probably wouldn't mind them. All of these amulets, you can barely see them. And I do still intend to hold on to the necromancer thing. So if we can uh, keep up appearances, all the better. Hey, so before we go in there, are you all right? I think so, and thanks for asking. I wanted to thank you for getting me this far, but after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. I think. I know your friends would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. 
Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. Bulky heart key. How dare you trespass here? Wait, Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my eyes. In Galmo. My lord, everyone! Serana has returned! I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it! My long lost daughter returns at last. I trust you have my elder scroll. After all these years, that's the first thing. The I've alchemical seen. ingredients. I guess I have the scroll. <laughs> Okay, about she has that. to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me, who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? I'm Valeria. I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter would have told you what we are. You're vampires. Not just vampires. We are among the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim. For centuries we lived here, far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. What happens now? You have done me a great service, and now you must be rewarded. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. And if I refuse your gift? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! Is the power that I offer now make your choice blue and ugly hmm. don't want to become a vampire I refuse your gift so be it you are prey like all mortals I banish you This is an important choice. But it's not the only chance to become a vampire like that. I think the choice there is do you want to side with the Dawn Guard organization or with these Volgihar vampires? And uh, the follow up quest, cha uh, quest chain will be dependent on that. Um, I'm not 100% on the choice we made, but it makes more sense to me at the moment. I'm certainly in no way against becoming a vampire at some point. But for now, no. I really need to discuss this with Isran. 
gonna be lovely trying to explain to him why I left the vampire go, left the Elder Scroll go, and all that. So I'm I'm sure he'll be understanding. I mean, we had a good reason to do it. It was because we are. Uh, uh, I'm sure I can think of something by the time I reach the bathroom. I love to see what options do I have to explain it away. I, mean, I, I really don't have any good reasons to be honest about that. I wonder what the... I'm, I'm interested in the reason though, because it, uh, it gives the thought process behind the people who actually wrote this. So what did they see? What was my character's reasoning for doing all that? So it could be a problem like missing pieces of a more complete puzzle, or maybe something I never thought about. That makes sense. It's always a possibility. Get gang banged by three guys. Not a pretty sight. I should have known it was only a matter of time before they found us. It's the price we pay for openly recruiting. We'll have to step up our defenses. I don't suppose you have some good news for me. Um, you didn't say anything. Keep your eyes open. Look at this. I should have known it was only a matter of time before they found us. It's the price we pay for openly recruiting. We'll have to step up our defenses. I don't suppose you have some good news for me. Not exactly. Damn. Well, what do you know? Vampires were looking for a woman trapped in the hollow. A woman? Trapped in there? That doesn't make any sense. Who is she? More importantly, where is she? Yeah, she wanted to go home, so I took her to her castle. Come on. She's the daughter of a powerful vampiric lord. Okay, the first option is just silly, I can't say that. Daughter of a powerful vampire lord. And so you delivered her to them. And they also have an elder scroll. They what? And you didn't stop them? You didn't secure the scroll. Okay. I'm lucky I made it out alive. That's nonsense. There were too many of them and only one of me. That's nonsense. I never got this chance. That's nonsense. These are all nonsense. Okay. It's like they exclude the part of the hollow cave and actually arriving in the full castle. Yeah, the, the reasoning is absolute horseshit. So uh, now at at least I don't feel bad about uh, shitting, shitting on the reasoning. This is just terrible. It's it's like it assumes that event when events happened in a very different order. Maybe it's possible they can happen. Although I think that what we did is the most logical and likely thing to happen. Okay, there were too many of them. Only one of me. So they have everything they wanted, and we're left with nothing. By the divines. This couldn't get much worse. This is more than you and I can handle. Well, we have to do something. Well, of course we do. I'm old, not stupid. 
We are just going to need some help. If they're bold enough to attack us here, then this may be bigger than I thought. I have good men here, but... There are people I've met and worked with over the years. We need their skills, their talents, if we're going to survive this. If you can find them, we might have a chance. Where can I find the people we need? Right to the point, aren't you? I like that. Not like those fools in the Order. We should keep it small. Too many people and we'll draw unwanted attention to ourselves. I think we'll want Serene Gerard. Breton girl, whip smart and good with tinkering. Fascination with the Dwemer. Weapons in particular. Last I knew, she was out in the reach. Convinced she was about to find the biggest dwarven ruins yet. She'll help us? Might need a little convincing, but she should. You'll also want to find Gunmar. Big brute of a Nord. Hates vampires almost as much as I do. Got it into his head years back that his experience with animals would help. Trolls in particular, from what I hear. Last I knew, he was out scouring Skyrim for more beasts to tame. Bring the two of them back here, and we can get started on coming up with a plan. Training in heavy armor. Well, at least you're smart enough to want to learn more. I'll show you what I can. Keep your eyes open. Uh, now we don't have to worry about training. Recruit Gunmar, recruit Serene Jubrard. Ah, so we can start strengthening the own guard. Carry weight is a terrible, terrible, terrible issue. What did exactly we pick up that weighs so much? A lot of crap by the looks of it. Weaponry mainly, okay. Okay, we're, we're definitely continuing with this. Good Ganema. Okay, they're both easy to reach. Where the hell is my manor? I'll try to disenchant some of the items. Uh, I don't know if we have the abilities or not. I need to slip them away and I'll... I'll end there. Hmm. I want to replan some of these. I'm sure we know some of these ingredients, if not most of them fully already. I don't know what's the point of making more at the moment. I guess I might as well kill the slaughter fish. How do you kill them? Can't really do anything. Uh... Ooh. How about ice? It seems to move past some of these edges. Um. Shit. The sun is right in my eyes. Can I kill it? Oh, 
I did. Where is he? You scale, is that it? I'm somewhat interested in seeing where it'll end up. I mean, if we do this again, I'd like to be able to tell. There's a little bit of a current here. They'll all very likely end up in the same, exact same fall point, no matter where we kill them. Are you gonna go through the fencing? Mm. So, somewhere on this edge anyway, and the netting will prevent them from moving on, so... the Sultan situation. Grand, grand, lesser, 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 and then a few kitties. Not good. Who died? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. A letter. Not sure who from. He wouldn't say, just that he was a friend of yours. Another like word of it. power location, I guess. Game making sure we keep getting these. Winstad Manor. Northwind Summit. Vampire armor, vampire boots. Do we get any circlets? Copper onyx. Well, it looks hideous, but it's a circlet. I'll store it here. Mm -hmm. Lexicon. 147 locks. Well, we might be able to afford extra crap to sell. We have enough soul gems to do a session with these, but I still like more. Because currently we mostly have heavy. That's fine, but once you reach, I guess, common level, then you start to be able to do items that have a decent amount of value. So you can do the trading thing. Training thing and re trading back money. If we just use petty gems, it doesn't particularly matter what type of gem jewelry we use, they, they still won't have enough value. Okay, that's the extra hundred pounds free weight, and we still have the equipment. So, right, so we can pick up uh, some stored crap from here and try to sell it away. Ebony mix, staff calm, lightning bolts. 
expulsion. And shield. Gilded arm. Major Condor. Why do I even have these? I must have made some kind of emergency jump at some point. That's the only explanation. Minor Archery Gauntlets? Jesus Christ, what sh horseshit. Okay, just making sure we can't disenchant any of these. I, I doubt I would have stored them if I could have just disenchanted them. Good, good, good. I'll do the maintenance work now. So next time we start, we can just immediately go after the new recruits. Daytime or night time? Very, very early morning, so I'll just go to Solitude. Definitely should arrive there during daytime. Ten AM the place is still closed. Interesting. Spare some gold for a veteran? Can you spare a septum? Lost an eye during the Great War, or I'd earn it myself. Are you really in the army? What? You see a man fallen on hard times, and you think he's been like that forever? I was there. I fought in the Great War. I was on the field at Anvil. And when I was struck down, they left me. You understand? They left me for dead. I didn't leave them. It's best you leave me be. I suppose. You know you can afford a second or two. Let's start with the smiths. You heard of Raven's Car Hollow? Cave on the island to the west. Place is a roost for those foul hag ravens. Raven's Car Hollow, hag ravens. People are telling me these about these places, but most of the time I don't even hear what they're saying. So I have these places on my map and I have no clue what's actually in there. True. Uh, bows and arrows for the mighty huntsman. Ebenese, Ebony War Axe. Perhaps I'll be seeing more of you. Perhaps. Seems there's no take a look. Anytime okay, we are both 200 arm. pounds free carry weight. It's only. Really more than we need. A coin or two for a veteran? It's not much to ask. Probably have a couple of trash items we want to get rid of. The difficult potion. said you got here. Take a look. Health and Magicka. The stamina, if nothing else. Ah, stabs. We have a lot of things to sell. Expensive things. Oh shit. Come back to bits and pieces anytime. Oh, uh, well, we have the. We have enough free carry weight, we don't have to sell any more of this. Not now. Is this open? Radiant Raymond. 
What kind of clothing options do you offer? You are not supposed to be in here. Can't a woman get a moment to herself? Leave me. Why not? Why not am I supposed to be here? It's eleven. Spare some gold for a veteran? I'll wait one more hour for going. Why hello, here to buy? If you have to ask the price, you might be in the wrong store. Breeches, gowns, clothes for any occasion, really. Boys and girls dresses. I like your hoods. Something interesting. Black robes, not enchanted. Well, well, well. Different type of blacksmith aprons. Two robes, boots. More boots. Boots, 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 boots. Shifts, hat, and tunic. More clothing. Clothes of various types. Not magical variants. College robes. Circles. Expert robes. Fine boots. And clothes. On hat. Gloves. Jewelry, hammer fill garb, various hats, master robes of restoration, miners' clothing, monks' robes, mourners' clothes. I realize that's a thing. Necklace of blocking disease, disease immunity, shock resistance 70%. Like yikes. Built regeneration, the armor, necromancer robes, radiant raiment, fine clothing, ragged boots, cap robe, pretty much red guard boots, more jewelry, shoes, and non magical jewelry, fearless oh. meeting. A lot of uh, jewelry and clothing. Real good. Surprisingly good, in fact. Thank you for your patronage. Oh, what delight. Another charming customer. Hello, I'm Gizli. But you can just call me Erica's sister. Everyone does. Okay. We'll speak again later. Yes, I think we will. Every one of them seemed to have something to say. We haven't really spoken to anything so we do, so probably a great place to get a lot of quests. Spare but that's some not for really a, a problem at the moment. We have we have um, too many to work with anyway. Ah, recruit Gunmar, recruit Serene Gerard. If there's one positive thing I can say about the DLC so far is that they we haven't really met anyone really unlikable. So even Serana, the vampire, has you been very reasonable. So Excluding the fact that we were a ha vampire hunter and we should have taken her to our leader and definitely taken the Elder Scroll. The reaction would have been to basically go with the flow would have been fairly reasonable otherwise. And she was very pleasant. She treated the fact that she was a vampire like another pack of life that didn't really matter much. That was it. 